for the Beaver Radio Network. I'm Brian Schultz. Beaver football team will open up the season at Wayne State, joined by one of the defensive captains, uh, D-lineman J.J. Ranke. First off, how was the summer? It was great. We had a lot of guys up here, got to do a lot of good things, and it was just fun for everyone to be together. I won't beat around the bush. Uh, last year was not a season that any of you guys liked record-wise. Uh, there were some spurts where you guys did some good things, both offensively and defensively, but how much did last year stink? How much do you use that as motivation? You know, no one wants to have a season like last year, and that really hurt a lot, especially for the older guys. We've always been, you know, 7-4, and 8-3, and three, and I think it motivated a lot of people. This has been a team that has historically, in the almost 20 years that Coach Tesh has been here, has been a, uh, a team that dominates at home and is probably a uh, win almost two-thirds of their games on the road. Very good record-wise, very good sound defensive minded teams what happened last year you know we had we were inexperienced we had some spots that had a lot of depth and then other spots like receiver we had to throw a lot of young guys in and they did what they could but it hurts when you don't have some vets there to at least show them the way and you know, I think we're going to be a lot better at that this year though as a guy who's been here for a number of years now what changes uh, from the time camp ends when school starts and uh, the, the time that you get into the, the wanted days and start gearing up for game week? Camp, uh, it gets to be a drag sometimes. It's just nonstop football, sometimes twice a day, but continuously for this year's 15, 16 practices. Uh, once we get out of camp, it's a lot more relaxed. You have one practice a day. Mondays we don't practice. The day before games, helmets. It's a lot more relaxed. It's more learning what you're going to do that week. So it takes less out of you, I think. How much do you have into the game plan uh, right now? Right now, we started watching some film. Uh, Bolte always wants to jump the gun and start <laughs> game planning for whoever we're playing. So we probably do more for Wayne than we will the rest of the teams because we've had more time to prepare. How physically draining and mentally draining is camp knowing that, oh, great, i got to go up against my teammates again and hit them instead of hitting somebody in a different colored uniform? Uh, it gets old sometimes, but honestly, I like going against them. We're pretty good friends, and I mean, tempers flare once in a while, but it's it's always fun, I think. I, I personally go against Dustin Dowd and Ben Johnson all the time, and we just joke around, make fun of each other, and try to get better. How much further aligned is the offense today to this point last year? You know, I think they've looked really good from last spring even. They've improved leaps and bounds. Uh, both our quarterbacks are battling out right now look awesome. Shields has come along a long ways. And Jordan Hine, he's kind of what we expect. He's a big physical guy, and we'll see what happens. How do, how's the dynamic of Jordan and Jesse on the, on the same team and in the same locker room going? Uh, I don't think there could be two more complete opposite guys. <laughs> For being brothers and playing on the same team, Jesse's pretty reserved and quiet, and then Jordan just loves to joke around and mess with everyone. Is it odd that you've got a center and a quarterback? I mean, those are the two guys that have to be in sync, and they're both brothers? Yeah, I think it's a little strange. Uh, I mean, Jesse's 300-something, and, well, and <laughs> Jordan's 210 and complete opposite positions. It's, it's a little weird defensive side uh how have the newcomers come along in your mind uh really good i hopefully a lot of the freshmen won't have to play but there's a couple i think that will step in and fill some of the holes from last year middle linebacker there's some guys if they'll be backups uh other than that we've had some guys switch positions from other spots so there won't be a lot of young guys on the field as freshmen anyway all the other defensive captains are uh, secondary guys. Um, how do the four of you guys uh, with uh, uh, you know Jesse on the offensive side, how do you guys all work together and bring this team together? You know, uh, never really thought of it that way, that Jesse's offense and we're defense. We all just kind of we do everything together at the beginning of practice. When the coaches tell one of us to go do something, we all get together and do it. Uh, it's not really offense and defense when it comes to being captain and leading the team. It's just we're all one team. Wayne's always a pretty sound, fundamental team. You expecting the same this year? Yeah. I mean, they had 
kind of a season like us last year. They lost a lot of games late by just a couple points here and there. So I'm sure they're working just as hard as we are, and they're going to be good. Best of luck to you, JJ. Thank you.